Good morning, second graders. I'm at a learning lab this morning, so instead of teaching you in the library, I'm teaching you with a video. And you better be good while I'm done or I will hear about it. <laughs> um, so we've been making bridges. We made bridges out of paper. We made bridges out of Legos. Um, we're gonna take a break from making bridges and then after this week, we're going to make a bridge um, just like the older kids are doing. It'll be fantastic and fun. Uh, but first we have to do a really important activity. Um, we need to um, use the scales and the crayons that are set up at the table to figure out how much the billy goats and the troll weigh. Because then we'll be able to test our bridges after we build them with, um, cause we, you know, we only have a few of these and, um, here's the deal. We don't want to test our bridges and have them break and then be done. We, we want to be able to slowly test them with something in the library so that, um, there's, we know how to fix them to make them sturdier so that when we finally do the final test, our bridges will work. All right. So, um, you have crayons at your spot and you have a scale. We have uh, four different kinds of scales. So I'm going to show you how to use each one really fast. Okay. So most of the scales look like this. They are, um, really easy to use. You just look at the little arrow right here and you want it to be pointing straight down in the center. And if it's not like, some, some of them might be a little bit off balance, like this one. You see the arrow is pointing off to the side. That's because the slider on this side is not centered. So what you wanna do is slide the slider so that the scale balances. Once you get it to balance, then you can use it. You can't use it until it's balanced because the goal with a, a scale like this is to get both sides to balance. All right. So I almost got it balanced here. So that's the, the red scales. We have mostly that's what we have in the library. Um, we also have a few of these white and uh, blue ones and they are the exact same thing. There's an arrow here that points down and you have a slider on this side that you slide um, to balance it out. Okay. Don't, don't try and make it balance by holding it. You need to slide it to, to make it balance. And you have to be patient with these things. Okay. Oops. Okay, I'm gonna let it go and see if it balances out. It looks like it might work. I'm gonna be patient. I'm not gonna keep touching it because that just makes it take longer to go still. We also have two other kinds of scales that are um, sort of, one of them is sort of similar. It's, it's this one right here. It has actual baskets here and it has the slider right here, just like these other two. And it has um, a sort of different looking kind of arrow, but you'll basically be lining it up just the same way. All right, um, and then we have, okay, so it's not moving, it is balanced now. All right, so that's how you balance it. I'm gonna put this one down here for a second and I'm gonna show you. Uh, we have a few that look like this. And these ones are um, just as good as the other ones. They're a little older um, and they're harder, they're different to balance out. So if it, if it um, settles down here and the arrow is not pointing straight down to the middle, then you're gonna need to ask for help to fix these because there is no slider to fix the balance, okay? Um, this one is working just fine though, it looks like. So now I'm ready to do my activity. I get to have little billy goat or middle billy goat, one or the other. I'm gonna do it with little. Um, I'm not playing with him. He's a tool, not a toy. Okay. I'm going to put him on one side and then I'm going to use my crayons and I'm not just going to throw a bunch of crayons in. 
All right, I'm going to put them in one at a time and count them. One, two, three, four. Okay, and I'm actually not gonna give you the answer. So I would keep putting them in there counting until it starts to balance out, all right? When, when it starts to balance out, um, it'll kind of look like this, like it'll start balancing out. And then at that point, you might wanna stop putting a crayon in or you might wanna take a crayon out try and get it to balance out. Um, if it's still not even, you could try putting a half a crayon in and see if that helps, because um, it might actually be like 10 and a half crayons. You don't know, you'll have to, you'll have to see. I'm not gonna give you the answers, so you'll have to figure it out. Um, once you figure out what little boy goat weighs, then you could try um, middle boy goat. Okay, some of you are actually gonna start with middle billy goat and then you'll get the little billy goat, all right? Um, so, and if, if you have time, you could maybe try big billy goat, maybe, if you have time. Um, I don't know if we have enough crayons in our bin for him. We might not, you'll have to see. Um, this is a partner activity. You will need to work with a partner who sits at your table. We've been having trouble working with partners. If you can't work with a partner who sits at your table when you're at your spot, then you won't be able to do this fun activity. You will sit out and watch other people do it. So you need to cooperate. You need to get along. You need to let both of you help do the work, okay? Um, and you need to make sure both of you are having fun because if someone's not having a good time, then one of you was not very nice, okay? So be nice to each other and see if you can figure it out because next week we're going to build bridges and we're going to want to be able to test them. So if we can put crayons on our bridge to see if it will hold, then we won't end up breaking our bridges with the heavy troll, right? We don't want that to happen, <laughs> okay? So that's your assignment. Um, oh, if you finish with little and, bill, and middle billy goat, um, ask what you can do. Raise your hand and let, let um, everyone know that you're done so that you can, because there might be something special that you can do, okay? All right, um, be good. Make sure you use walking feet and keep your voice level down, okay? Don't be too noisy. Have fun.